guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new. My name is Sarah, also known as Laugh Love Langella, and here on my YouTube channel, I love to share all things home decor, styling tips, DIYs, and budget friendly decorating in our first home. If you missed my last video, I have done my early Christmas home tour. I did it in two different parts, so there's a narrated version as well as the silent version, but I would definitely check those out. I'm super thrilled with how our home has come together for this Christmas season, but even though we are fully decorated, that by no means means I'm done with sharing decorating ideas and tips with you guys. So in today's video, we're going to be decorating the coffee table and I'm going to show you three different ways you can style it for Christmas. So without wasting any more time, let's get into decorating. So I'm going to start off with this linen tray I got from Target earlier this year. And then I have this beautiful compote bowl from A Floral. I love this year round. It's nice to have another texture and a color in the space. And these are those burgundy stems from Hobby Lobby. And when it comes to styling, I like to make sure I have different shapes as well. So I have the rectangular tray with the roundness of the bowl. Then you guys have absolutely loved this as much as I have. It is this stunning candle from Anthropology. It's awesome. I know it's a little pricey, but it's awesome because even when the candle runs out, it's just such a beautiful decor piece. So we're gonna add that. And then for practicality, we have these shears to cut a candle. A great tip for budget-friendly decorating is going to a thrift store and finding a book of any kind. My husband's grandmother actually gave me this. It's a book about women and horses. And the cover of it was really colorful, but when you take the cover off, you have this beautiful book. So this is a great way of budget friendly decorating. Then again, we're gonna add another texture into the space with this teak bowl. I got it from House and Home last year, but they sell the same one on Amazon, as well as some little bells for the holiday season. So this was a super simple table styling while still adding a pop of color with the red into the space. It makes a beautiful, scenery. be adding the medium house candle. I love that small one so much. I went for the bigger one. I have zero regrets. I honestly want the large, but it is quite pricey, but we're going to add that to contrast the wood here. I'm going to add one of our favorite Pottery Barn reindeer. And then this little bottle brush tree I got from House and Home last year, but I'll link some similar stuff as well. And a great way to incorporate seasonal decorations is having a bowl of ornaments. These ornaments I actually made for a DIY in my last video, so I'll have that link down below if you'd like to see how I did that. But it makes a beautiful statement and is super budget friendly as well. And this one I love because again, it's keeping things nice and neutral and simple. There are a couple of investment pieces with the candle and the Pottery Barn Reindeer. However, Aldi's has a very similar one. I have not been able to find it in store, but if you are lucky enough, you could take a look for that. And then these ornaments I did in the DIY were super, super budget friendly.
that found wood pedestal again with that black vase from Target. And these stunning pine cone candle holders. And this is the larger teak wood bowl of the set. These ornaments I did in my DIY video, and I put them in with a couple pine cones and some sprigs of greenery. I was gonna do three but I'm gonna do four because why not <laughs> so this is another one of the simplest styling we have this antique find is a cement pot so we're bringing a good texture in here with this very modern black and this tray I found at Target and spray painted it Pottery Barn has a very very similar one you can also find them at like home goods and then we're gonna add those rustic bells to make a nice visual impact while keeping things simple. much for tuning into my channel today. If this was your first time here, I would love it if you would subscribe and join my YouTube family and be sure to hit that notification bell. It'll alert you anytime I have a new upload available to view. I hope you enjoyed today's video and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.